Oh, Sarah, tell us a story. Tell us a story. I'd love to tell you a story. I'd love to read you a poem. My name is Sarah Richardson, and I'm here with Timmy Sistrunk and Darrell Whitlock, my little friends. I'd like to read you a poem today, boys and girls, about the night before. Are you ready? Yes! Yeah. Twas the night before AEL week two, and all through our houses, the iPods were charging. They didn't need mouses. New ideas were hung on our courses with care. Technology opened syllabi and clickers to share. Rubric ideas were dancing about as we thought of the content of this report out. When up on the screen, what did we see but material about accessibility? We thought of the ways we would change up our classes to appeal to the styles of diverse student masses. We recognize there is much to be done to modify our classes to be engaging and fun. Sarah considered the uses of clickers while visions of student involvement flicker. And Tim sees Kaltura as a program of choice for engaging his students and giving them voice. When up on the screen, Darl heard with a clatter a technology choice she thought really mattered. Mashup seems like a really cool deal that brings ideas together with a really cool feel. We're so thankful for how TLP has delivered on Claudine, on Anne, on Jim, and on Peter. They've asked us to talk about some of our worries. We're concerned that the ideas have been such a flurry that we might try to put way too much in our courses and become overwhelmed by creative forces. Or worse, we might not get done all our wishes, for the time is too short and we're all so ambitious. But as we reflect on week two on this eve, we are most grateful for our small group of three. We all come from cross campus in different departments. We, for, we forged ideas and friendship in different compartments. There's more words that I'd like to fit into this poem, but I'm now out of bandwidth and have to get going. So we close out this week and look forward to next. Happy weekend to all. We wish you the best. Yes.